Hey guys, today I have an opening for you, and today what we'll be opening is this! I finally found one! It's been so hard to get one of these in hands. Um, my locals don't, they're sold out every single time when they get a new, uh, box. Or when I go to my, uh, Walgreens or Walmart, they're always sold out, but I found them in one, on uh, a Walgreens, like, you know, 20 miles away. But I found one, and man, I was so happy to find at least one. They were all sold out. I just found one of these. And I've been dying to get this since Halloween, man. Since Halloween. But yeah, I'm, I'm glad. And I wanted this for my birthday. You know, three co three bo three uh, structures of this so I can make this with my Akashis. But we didn't ever, I never got that. So let's open this thing up. I'm so giddy right now. I've been dying to open this. I really don't want to throw out the box because I really like it. So yeah, I, was, I actually like the box design. Pretty cool. Um, we do get... Um, the rules, I actually like the rules. I actually enjoy now that the rule books have now a nice design that I can keep. And the playman, which I always, you know, am pissed at these because they're made out of paper. But look at that. That's actually pretty good. Look at that. You got um, Red Eyes Zombie Dragon. You got um, the new guy. What's his name? I don't know. He looks so cool. Wow, this is actually pretty cool. I want to frame this. I want to frame this. I want to actually frame this. This actually looks so good. I, I, I'm keeping that. I'm keeping that thing. Oh, I'm so happy. I'm just happy that I got... Finally got this. So here we are. We get, uh, And we have here... Red Eye Zombie Necro Dragon. This is pretty cool. Okay, let's open this that way up. So we got plastic. Simple. So... Oh, and we also get a you know dual links uh semi slash tokens in my opinion um you have your yugi and you say uh because now they have the um the synchro um update if i'm correct uh, so there's a qr code there free scan on me if you want to do that you can get um place to an uh, iphone steam google play i'm not sponsored but i hope i get sponsored no i'm not gonna get sponsored for that thing but yeah, um, it's a nice, it's, re it's really cool for a token. Oh, they're not doing the thing. Um, the older ones had the Eye of the Newest right there, but not anymore. Which is kind of sad. Made it more collectible, viable collectibles. You just get the tokens, but not anymore. So, we got Red Eyes, Zombie, Necros, Dragon. Now, it's a really cool card. I like the, the art style. Like, he got, um, like, Red Eyes got so beat up like in 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 hell right now so it's a zombie single he's a level seven if i'm correct yeah he's a level seven and it reads against 100 of attack and defense for each zombie monster on the field and in the graveyard when another zombie monster is destroyed by battle you can specialize one zombie monster from either graveyard to your field you can only use this effect of uh necro uh red eyes zombie necros once per turn and it's uh and it's pretty cool card pretty cool oh yeah we got this guy um the um what's his name um before you uh yeah it's uh tatsu tatsune tatsune the uh the little seahorse dragon that got um they got destroyed now now he's a dead fish he's now sea, uh tatsu necro uh, poor little guy, he got beat up, um, I think because of, like, uh, like, you know, a lot of formats used him when he was, you know, relevant, he was, you know, tortured to death for many combos, and look what happened to him. Uh, poor little guy, he's a level 3, he's a zombie, he's a tutor, that's good. And this card's normal summon or, uh, slash set monster would be used as synchro material, uh, one monster in your hand can be used for as the other material. If you do this, uh, all materials from the summons are banished instead of being sent to the graveyard. You cannot special summon monsters as that zombie monsters. Pretty cool card. I like it. I'm so sad that he's like that. Aww. And here is the big guy himself. He's a level 8 if I'm correct. Four, five, six, seven. Yeah, he's a level 8. And here we are, we got Doom King Ball Balladrach. This guy looks so crazy. Look at that art, man. I'm just, I'm, I'm, I'm appraising this, this art because the zombie, the, the zombie horde deck, structure deck, it's a really good structure deck. I'm glad, I'm glad that this came out. 
really cool, man. Um, and people are playing this deck a lot, and it's a rogue deck. So it reads: During the standby phase, if a face-up fa uh, face card in is in the field zone, and this card is in your graveyard, you can special summon this card in the fence position. You can only activate uh, one of these effects of Doom King uh, Ballet Dorch once per turn, once per per chain when a zombie monster except Doom King is activating an effect except during the damage effect quick effect you can apply one of these effects one negate that effect or banish one monster from either graveyards wow that's actually a pretty cool card a really great beat a really good uh, boss monster I gotta say I gotta say that's pretty cool oh this is actually pretty cute ne necro world banshee that's actually pretty cute i actually like the artwork i think this was the uh the searcher for the uh zombie world field card yeah zombie world in the field cannot be destroyed by a card effect oh and also protects it and you can banish this card oh it's a quick effect uh you can banish this card and add a zombie world directly from your hands to your deck from, the, from your from, uh or deck wow that's actually pretty cool. Oh, here's um, ah, uh, poor glow up ball. Ah, <laughs> uh, poor glow up ball. Yeah, because we tortured him so much. Poor guy. He's now a zombie. So it's now glow up, glow up bloom instead of glow up ball, ball. So he's a zombie tuner. It reads: If this card is sent to the graveyard, you can banish this card. For, um, from your graveyard, add a level five or higher zombie monster from your deck to your hand. Uh, it from the deck instead also in either case you cannot special summon monster for the rest of the turn except for zombie you can only use this effect of global bloom once per turn so he's the the searcher for uh, doom king pretty cool oh. so that's pretty cool um, new cards um kasha never heard of this card uh i don't know this card i've never seen this card but wow that's a high level uh level requirement Cannot be normal summon, must be special summon from the hand by controlling two or more zombie monsters. If you do, so you can special summon this special uh, this card with special summon. Shuffle as many other monsters on the field as possible into the deck. If you do, this card gains 1000 of attack for every face up monster uh, shuffled into the deck. This way, whose original type was zombies. Okay. Okay. Oh. Here's Red Eyes Zombie Dragon. Yeah, I remember this guy. It was so cool. Yeah, this is when um Red Eyes Darkness Dragon went to um uh just died and just became a zombie. Malevolent Mech Goken. Never seen this one. Never seen the zombie. So you can normal summon this card without tributing. Once per turn during your end phase, if this card was summoned this way, send it to the graveyard. Then take damage equal to the original attack of the of in the in the graveyard. This card must be. Oh, wow, that's a really, really odd card. Oh, endless decay. Oh yeah, I have this on uh, super rare. Yeah, pretty cool card. Uh, we have Paladin of the Crusaders, uh, Cursed Dragon. I remember this card when I was a kid, man. This thing was a uh, pretty cool card when it was you know like that. Immortal Ruler. Oh, I love that artwork. Very cool. Oh, so this can actually add your zombie world back to your hand. Not bad, but I, I think Necro World um, Banshee is way better. In, uh, obviously, because um, it protects um, your zombie world and plus you can add her. Pretty cool. Oh, you got the reprint for Zombie Master. Pretty cool card. This helps with the Skullmeister deck. Uh, I've seen a lot of plays. This is a great card. I highly recommend uh, if you get this deck. I highly recommend you use the Skullmeister um, advantage of the reprints. Then we have a Tristian, the Knight of the Underworld. I think I've seen this card. But yeah, pretty cool. Then we have a Suki and Gozuki. Pretty cool. Not um, really good. Mo really good. Amazing zombie monsters. Um, I'm glad they got reprinted. Uh, you never know because I wanted a new, newer version of Mizuki and Gozuki. Uh, pretty cool. So let me just move this because uh, we're just like checking out all these cards. I'm just like having the fun time with this because I finally got this, this structure deck, and you know, for fun, man. I'm happy to get. It. I really like the zombie 
uh, monsters. Um, so yeah. Oh yeah, uh, Shuten Doji. I did get, I had the Ultra Rare, but I sold it a long time ago. But this is a great card. Um, really good card, and I have a Ray Ray Pins. Uh, it reads, uh, once per turn, you can act on one of these effects. You can banish two zombies from your graveyard, draw a card. You can target one banished zombie from your monster and place that target on the top of the deck, which is pretty cool. You can activate his effect and return Necro World Banshee from the uh, banish to the top of the deck. Pretty cool idea. Dang, look at that. Pyramid Turtle. Man, this guy was a, this guy was a beast when I was a kid. Pretty cool. Um, Goblin Zombie. No, in cool card. Oh, I got this girl. Uh, it sold uh, Bell of the Underworld. I have the uh, Gold Rail at uh, in one of the better. And you get um, Shira Nui uh, Solitaire. Great reprint. Another great thing. Um, right now, Shira Nui um, Solitaire uh, from the Battles of Legend. Battles of Legends did get a reprint. I know it's rare. I think it's a dollar, but it's good to have this because um, if you still can't access the uh, Shira Nui for Ultra, there's always this kind of budget version. So yeah. We get Uni Uni Zombie, great reprint. I'm glad that we got that. Um, Marianton Mites. I never heard of this card, so yeah. Beast of the Pharaoh. I remember this card. This was the weirdest thing that I've ever seen. It's weird that it's an Earth, and almost all of these zombies are fire or dark. Scapegoats. Um, a really funny card. <laughs> and now for. Now we're going for the spell. We have Zombie Necronize. 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 If a level 5 or higher zombie monster on the field is targeted, uh, one uh, monster of, uh, target, one monster of your opponent's control, take control of it until the end of the end phase. During your main phase, if this card is in your graveyard, you can shuffle one of your banished zombies from your deck, and if you do, set this card from your banished banishes banish it but banish it instead when it leaves the field you can only use this effect once per turn Very cool card then we got zombie power struggle whoa so red eyes and uh, doom king have a beef and i know that you can try one zombie monster on the field until the end phase of this turn it gains 1000 of attack and loses 1000 of attack or loses actually not or loses 1000 of attack during your main phase, if this card's in your graveyard, you can shuffle one banished zombie from your deck. If you do, said this. If this, um, but banish it when it leaves. You can only use this effect once per turn. Pretty cool card. Then you got Zombie World. It's Zombie World. Everybody knows this card is crazy. Uh, all monsters on the field be um, from your graveyard becomes field and graveyard becomes zombies. The other player can tribute so many monsters and stuff. Zombies. Ooh, what's this? Overpower eyes. Oh, okay, so you can make a zombie attack. That. Pretty cool design. It reminds me of um, the Dracula movies, the original ones. Pretty cool. I like that. Book of Life. Um, great that it has a reprint. Um, it's been a while since we since we had to reprint a Book of Life. Uh, more nicer version, not uh, not an updated, you know, uh, design of it. Pretty cool. I like it. Uh, we have a call by the mummy. This thing is crazy now because of the FTK. Uh, bringing uh, the uh, mountains of the souls, bringing it out really easy. It's crazy. Uh, Foolish Barrel is always good. You never know when you need it. Monster Gate is another great uh, re Monster Gate is a good card. And we got Dragged Down into the Grave. Now, this is a great card and a great reprint to get. So it reads Both players reveal their hands. Each chooses one card from your uh, either hands of your opponents. Then you discard them, those the chosen cards. Both players' hands. Both players draw a card. Pretty cool, uh, pretty cool uh, card. Glad this was reprinted. This thing was, I think, like expensive, by the way, in a way. Burial from the different dimension. Really good reprint. Uh, really good pre reprint. You never uh, to get have it because uh, last one I think was in Dino Smashers structure deck. If I'm correct, I don't remember. But yeah, cool reprint. Oh, and now we got shared ride. For the rest of this turn, each time a card is added to the main fate, uh, added to the uh, deck or the graveyard, your opponent's hand, except by drawing them, you immediately draw a card. Basically, this is an, uh, uh, a card that people have been trying to get, but it was too expensive. It was like to 10 to 20 to $30, but I'm glad I got a reprint because it was only a gold rare. Now it's a common, so people can get it easier and cheaper. Now we have Return of the Zombies. Ooh. 
turtle. Look at that artwork. That actually is pretty good. I'm praising this artwork. I'm sorry, but look at that artwork. Like that is go that is gorgeous. I'm sorry. Banish one zombie monster on the field and special summon one zombie monster from your graveyard or of the players who controls it to the airfield in the fence position. Sorry. If this uh, this card is sent to the uh, is in your graveyard, you can shuffle one banished zombie. It has the same thing that you can set it back and if it leaves as we go Spanish. Pretty cool. Okay, we have Haunted Shrine. Cool card. Um pretty cool card. I don't know what it does. Um Trap of the Imperial Tomb. Oh what's what's this? This kinda looks it kinda looks great keeper ish. When a zombie monster special summoned from your opponent's graveyard and field, you can target two cards on the field in this room. Interesting card. Oh, Needle. Oh, uh, yeah, now I'm um, down it right there. So, Needle Bug Nest. Send the five top cards of your deck to the graveyard. Pretty cool. Pretty cool idea. Then another great reprint here is Meta Warriors. Take a field card from your deck, either activate it or add it to the hand. Pretty cool. Anti-Spell Fragrance, a great reprint. People have been dying to get an Anti-Spell Fragrance reprint for so long. We got it. And then Mask of Restriction. So, guys, this is it. And, yeah. I'm happy to get this uh, great reprints. Great. A lot of cards. Sorry what happened there, but uh, I'm not going to even edit this. I was, I'm was, i so happy right now. I'm just hoping that I got the, the structure deck. I'm not going to even, you know, I'm not going to edit this or whatever. But, so, guys... Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys soon.